uh, we can do pagination in Streamlit app. Uh, uh, so pagination would look something similar to this, where we have multiple pages uh, doing different stuff, uh, helping us in modulating the entire app. So how this can be done is as easy as a Hello World program in Streamlit. We don't have to do much, nothing much. Uh, uh, first of all, in our root project folder where we are uh, trying to develop our app, we need to create uh, a subfolder called as pages and then uh, form Python scripts align with some name that would be forming a page. So abc.py, xyz.py now, the, the name of these files that is abc or xyz will form the paginated component in our app. So there's nothing that we need to do. We just need to create these pages and one page outside or within inside in the pages folder as well, no issue. That will be called. So as of now, I have called it uh, overview py, overview.py. And there would be for two more pages alongside overview py, that is apc.py and xyz.py. So the file that you would be calling alongside all the files present in the pages folder would form a page uh, in your uh, streamlit web app. So let's see uh, how, it, uh, how it runs. So what I'm doing is that I'm running the command py minus and streamlet run overview.py so it's a command that we need to run to uh, any streamlet app where I'm trying to call the overview.py now this leads to hosting of this uh, streamlet app and eventually the landing page becomes this overview where I'm trying to build out something for myself now as you can see these are the two files that are present in the pages folder uh, in our uh, project folder uh, so eventually or any file that is present in the pages folder will form uh, our page in the streamlet app.